a right view of God in Psalms chapter 51 verse 4 against thee thee only I have sinned and done what is evil in thy sight so that thou art justified when thou dost speak and blameless when thou dost judge true confession involves a proper understanding of God today we will see a second element of true confession in David's prayer in Psalm 51. True confession requires not only a proper view of sin, but also a proper view of God. David gives us an understanding of four essential truths about God. First, God is holy. Affirming God's omniscience, David declared, Behold, thou dost desire truth in the innermost being, and in the hidden part, thou will make me know wisdom, found in verse 6. David knew that because God is holy, he is never satisfied with mere external behavior. Second, God is powerful. God prayed, purify me with hyssop, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Make me to hear joy and gladness found in verse 7 through 8. David believed God had the power to change him. Unlike some who think their sinful habits are too strong for him to overcome. Third, God will chastise believers for their sins. David pleaded with God, let the bones which thou hast broken rejoice, found in verse 8. He alluded to the way shepherds sometimes dealt with wayward sheep. They would take such troublesome sheep and break one of their legs. Then they would set the leg and carry the sheep while the leg healed. Afterwards, the sheep would remain close to the shepherd. Through this picturesque metaphor, David described God's chastisement of him for his sin. Fourth, God is a forgiving God. Hide thy face from my sins, pleaded David, and blot out all the iniquities Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, thou God of my salvation, found in verse 9 and also 14. David obviously believed God would forgive his sin, or he would never have asked him for forgiveness. In Isaiah chapter 43, verse 25, God himself affirmed that he is a forgiving God. I, even I, am the one who wipes out your transgressions for my own sake, and I will remember your sins. Does your confession reflect a right view of God? Praise God for his holiness, power, and forgiveness. Amen. God bless you. Until next time.